with another one. Today we're going to be looking at an organ raccoon and an Iowa raccoon. The Iowa raccoon is from Iowa Trapper on YouTube and the organ raccoon I caught last That's year. Real quick. This is the organ raccoon, right? The fur is a little more bristly than the um, Iowa one. Um, this one's real gray. This is real gray and black. Pretty gray on it. Um, as you can tell, gray and black. Nice stripes on it. A nice stripe down the side. Real pretty fur. Real soft. Um, the fur is, like I said, a little more bristly on the organ raccoon. And or the organ raccoon is a subspecies of the general raccoon. We have a northwest or Pacific Northwest species um, subspecies. And the Midwest has a different subspecies in different parts of the United States as different species. You can look that up online. A little bit of digging and you can find it. But, um, yeah, pretty fur. This one's the organ fur. Real pretty. And nice tail on it. Real nice stripe tail. Real su real supple. Real pretty fur. Real pretty. That's the organ fur. And I'll give you overall size comparison when I look at the, the two of them together. Here's the Iowa raccoon. Pretty fur. Right? Big, pretty fur. This is a huge coon. And there's pretty tail. It says, this one has a little bit of red in it. Um, a little bit of yellow to it. A beautiful stripe. As you can tell, it has a little bit of orange. Um, a little bit of white or gray. A little bit of um, black. As you go down, it's quite pretty. The tail. Look at that. This particular fur, like I said, from Iowa Trapper on YouTube. You can email him at iowatrapper2 at gmail.com. Ask him about buying some of his furs. It, I bought it real good quality. Um, he's real high quality when it comes to prepping his fur, finishing his fur. He does it to a very specific standard. It takes a lot of pride in it. He did a fantastic job in this one. Look at that. Such an awesome, awesome from the face to the ear, the head area, the tail. Just super pretty. We'll look at my raccoon one more time to compare it once again. The Oregon raccoon. This one's like more specific gray. Real gray, a little bit of highlight in the orange and the tips, and black stripes. Of course, this is a very distinctive color in the tail. I slipped up on the tail, missed part of the tail, but there it is. Real pretty. Real pretty fur. Now we're going to take a look. We're going to step back, rearrange the furs, and we're going to take a look at how long they are and the differences. All right, let's take a look at the two raccoons. This one's fur just needs to be brushed a little bit more, but this is the Iowa raccoon. From Iowa Trapper. This is my raccoon from Oregon. They're two different subspecies. If you look at them, there's quite a bit of difference. The, this is a 5XL on the right. That's, that's a pretty big raccoon. We don't get them that big around here. And you look down and there's the tails. Very pretty raccoons. The faces on them. Pardon the debris in the background. Unboxing stuff. Look how pretty that is. All right, that's a look at the Oregon raccoon versus the Iowa raccoon. Have a good day. Thanks for watching. Subscribe, like, comment, subscribe.